Multiplying certain single digit numbers can be tough. Today I'm going to show you how you can use your hands to help multiply numbers from 6 to 10. We need to label each finger on our hands like this, starting from the thumb and working out. For the video I've printed off numbers, and I'm sticking them to my fingers with some blue tack. You could write the numbers on some tape and stick them to your fingers, but after a bit of practice you'll find you don't even need to label them. So to use it, here's what to do. Let's say we want to multiply 7 by 7. We touch these two fingers together, like this, which creates two groups of digits. Those which are touching, here, and digits which aren't touching, those outside the circle. To get the answer to 7 times 7, we obtain the first number by seeing how many of our fingers are touching, here. The answer is 1, 2, 3, 4. The second number is generated by multiplying the remaining digits on the left hand by those on the right hand. In this case it's 3 times 3, which is 9. So the answer to 7 times 7 is 49. If we want to do 8 times 7, we put digit 8 on the 7. Now our first digit is 5. And our second number is 2 times 3, which is 6. 56. If we need to multiply 8 times 8, we cross those fingers, which gives us the first digit of 6, and the second digit of 4. 64. And 9 times 8 would be 7 and 2. 72. 9 times 9 equals 81. 6 times 6 is interesting. We have the first digit of 2, and the second digit is 4 times 4, which is 16. So we have to carry the 1 over the 2 and add them together to make 3, giving us a final answer of 36. 7 times 6 is similar. First digit is 3, and the second digit is 3 times 4, 12. Carry the 1 over the top, add it to the 3, and our final answer is 42. So now you know how to use your hands to work out those harder single digit multiplications. Pretty cool, huh? It's a great method to help you out or double check your workings if you're not sure. If you want to see another method which will help you with larger, more complex multiplications, you can click on the link or take a look at some of my other videos. Have fun, stay safe, and as always, thanks for watching.